the gospel is a word. I want us to get that this morning. The gospel is a word to be spoken. It's a word to be proclaimed. It's a word to be explained. You cannot demonstrate the gospel. You cannot demonstrate the gospel. The gospel must be explained. It must be proclaimed. It is a word to be delivered. In other words, you can't go, watch how I mow my lawn. You pick it up. Got it? That doesn't happen. The gospel must be explained, taught, proclaimed, spoken. Now, the effects of the gospel can be seen. And the effects of the gospel can and should be demonstrated. And the effects of the gospel can be lived out in such a way that creates questions for how we're living in which we would then respond to with what? A word. So let us not fall into thinking, oh, we'll just live these really great lives and people will get it. We're called to follow Jesus. We're called to live in such a way that demands a gospel explanation. But then we are also called to give the gospel in an explanation. 